Well, we've got a mystery mailbox find today, and Nina's all over this. This box is enormous, as you can see by the size of my kitty cat. Probably weighs about 40 or 50 pounds, and uh, it's going to be chock full of new releases from Greenlight, Auto World, and possibly other manufacturers. Let's get this box opened up. We are in the main portion of the Diecast Museum where there's a bit more table space to review everything. Where we've got lots of room in the Diecast Museum, surrounded by some of our favorite cars. Some of those awesome green lights, Auto World, Hot Wheels, M2. Well, thank you for joining me today, guys. We've got this huge box. It actually came from WholesaleDieCastCollectors.com. Uh, it did not come from eBay, but I don't remember what I've got in here because obviously there's just too much. So we're going to see if we can open it up. Holy, it's going to be a tough one. I'll probably have to struggle with it for a bit here, but we'll figure it out. And uh, once we get this first lid open, things will go a little easier, I think. There we go. So we're going to kind of pre-set up our videos for the week as we go here. There's going to be more than one video's worth of cars in here. See if I can turn it for you guys. Just so you can see what I am up against. Check it out. A huge, huge supply of boxes within boxes. So some of these boxes, we're going to have to just figure it out as we go. Wow, it's a lot of die cast to buy at one time, isn't it? Got green light, auto world, auto world, auto world, so much auto world. Oh, we've even got Hot Wheels Premium, and it just goes on and on. I think we'll stop there because we're into some Lucy's in there, so I'm just gonna get these boxes kind of figured out. We don't necessarily need to go through all the bubble wrap, but we've got Auto World Premium 2021 Release 4. That's gonna be pretty cool. Yeah, we'll save the bubble wrap for later. That's gonna be squeaky, squeaky. And we've got uh, premium release four as well. So that's A and B over there. Uh, this is the Hot Wheels 956M case. So that's the premium uh, Fast and the Furious set. So that one's a fairly new one as well. I think that was the brand new one, actually. The green charger. Uh, and I think that one has the, the Treasure Hunt Corvette in it as well. So we're going to have to check that out. Uh, we've got green light here. What is this one? Can't read it for the... The packaging, so we'll just do a quick little cut on this one and see if we can identify what we've got in this box. Uh, vintage Ad Cars Series 5. Strange, I thought I already got that, but oh well. Maybe it's new. That would be really cool. Uh, what else we got? Uh, 2021 Release 3. Full set there. I don't think I got the, that's the Auto World, Premium Release 3. Uh, and here is A and B on that one. So, yeah, I don't think I got the those complete sets when I did the review, so we'll probably look at those again. Uh, another Auto World premium release four, and here's another one as well. Well, wow, I appear to have bought duplicates of each of those cars. I like to sometimes do the openers and save them on the packaging, especially with Auto World. It's the one, well, that and Johnny Lightning. I seem to have trouble with those ones opening them up if I don't have a duplicate, because the packaging can just be so nice, and I particularly like to uh, collect those ones, put them on the wall. What have we got here? Got some uh, very exciting looking SD trucks, green light. We've got the SD trucks. Check it out, 1982 Chevrolet C60 propane truck. Wow, that is awesome. And that's series 14. Here is series 22. What? Yes, SD trucks. And then we've got HD trucks. This one is 2019 step van. So also super cool. There's a few more vehicles to look out for on the back of the package. This one does not have that. This one does uh, more of a mystery. So we've got those opening up there. More bubble wrap. And tissue. Certainly not sad about anything, so I don't need to use the tissue today. <laughs> How could you be sad? It's like Christmas in March right now. And we've got Johnny Lightning. Wow. These are awesome matching pair of trucks, alternate colors, and there's the first one. These are limited 10,013 pieces, and this is release three of the classic gold series. Just one of my favorite trucks of all time, the uh, 1950 Chevrolet. Wow, beautiful. 
So we definitely have lots of interesting content to show you guys as this week unfurls. Actually, we're heading into the end of the week, so I'm going to have a weekend video for you guys. And then just a ton of stuff coming out for Monday and beyond. Uh, some Auto World, some Johnny Lightning in here. Probably a triple kit, really. Uh, I don't know which release is this one. Oh, release two. So maybe that's one of the cars I missed. I did miss a lot of Auto Worlds in 2021. Despite doing quite a few reviews on them, I didn't have complete collections. And a really nice International Scout from Johnny Lightning. That is also from release three. And we've got two more bundles of these. And then it just, I still can't see the bottom of the box. Check it out. Check it out. Cannot see the bottom of this box. So it's just uh, a lot of goodies in here. How much did I spend on this box? I think it was about $800 Canadian. Oh well. I missed out on a lot of cars. This typically happens. The two worst times a year for me in spending on diecast are December and March. Because that's December when I'm getting all the, all the new stuff that's coming out for Christmas. And then March is kind of... Um, the catch up for all of the stuff that I missed in December. It's just a, it's crazy. So we've got two awesome vans from the classic gold series, Johnny Lightning. And wow, check out the graphics on the card art there. Oh, I don't know if I can open them. Those are going to be wall hangers for sure. So some of these are wall hangers. Uh, really tough to do with the new Johnny Lightning classic gold stuff. Uh, really stepping up their game. The awesome choice of casting. They're not just throwing paint on whatever they have. They're making some pretty sweet castings. And we've got another one of these uh, green light vintage ad cars. Was that series five? Yeah, so I've got a full duplicate set. I did not need that full duplicate set of vintage ad car series five. Oh, well, it's a good series. Probably one of the best ones. I think I, I had said that before. Uh, and then we've got the alternate release two on the uh, Cadillac. Or the, Cadillac Eldorado, 75 Cadillac Eldorado, right there. So that's going to be pretty sweet to have, just in case I miss them. And if not, I always can use extras of that particular casting. Going to go to the junkyard, get weathered up. Uh, what do we got going on here? More uh, heavy-duty stuff from Greenlight. Kind of the wrong knife to use. More like a $1 kitchen knife, but we'll get there. Now, WholesaleDieCastCollectors.com, I'm not sponsored by them. I paid it for all these with my own money. Uh, but they do have pretty good prices, even for Canadians, uh, on things that you're having trouble getting in uh, your local market. So here we have HD Trucks. This is another vehicle from that set. We're going to do a full review on these. None of this is getting opened up in this video today. 73 Winnebago Chieftain. That will be its own video. Uh, maybe someone's already done lots of reviews for these online, but you know, I like to do my own personal review on these because it's just exciting to open them up with you guys. We've got the International Juristar with finally, finally, it comes with dumpsters. Thank you, Greenlight, for listening, guys. Good job. We asked for dumpsters, we got dumpsters because we've had a few garbage trucks that could use dumpsters. Now, if you need a couple dumpsters, just buy yourself a bunch of these SHD Truck Series 22 and you too. And get some dumpsters for your trucks. Uh, where are those trucks? Right here. Just do a little roll back. That's the truck you want to get for your dumpster because it's got the apparatus and now you can see you've got the matching dumpsters which is absolutely fantastic. So we'll just put that safely out of the way. We're not going to smash it off the table. So much going on here. Pardon my excitement. And more SD trucks. Oh, yes. A shorty of the 82 C60 uh, fertilizer truck. Nina's down in the house again. I don't know if she disappeared for a little bit, but now she's back. You going to come up here and check out all the mess, or are you just going to sniff bubble wrap? Bubble wrap it is. Where's the other one? Oh, yeah. So we've got two different trucks. One's an air truck. One's a fluid truck. Best I can tell. I think if that, hopefully that camera's catching that. I don't know. We're running out of room here. Whoa, and I almost did it. I almost, I almost knocked the truck off the table. So I'm just going to put that up there on my display shelf. Oh, and we've got a matching truck. Well, come on back here. We still need you. I'm not done with you. Check that out. We've got two different types of uh, refuse trucks. 2020 Mac LR rear loader refuse truck. This time with green and white. Got the waste management decal down on the front door. I don't know if that was even in the camera range, but oh well. And we have it on this one too. 
but it has the bigger logo on the side as well. I think we're done with you now. Whoa. Don't pick it up by the loading arms. Next. Still can't see the bottom of the box. Ah, ooh, 81 Dodge Diplomat from the Texas Department of Public Safety. And we've got the Auto World 2018 Jeep Wrangler 4x4. I did not get it in yellow. This is a, <clears throat> pardon me, alternate for the uh, pink version, I believe. It's an exclusive, a Miho exclusive. Really good packaging, guys. If you guys are watching this unboxing of the product you sent me, really nice uh, way of doing it. Appreciate it. Absolutely no way these uh, cars or packaging can be damaged. I've been buying from WholesaleDieCastCollectors.com for quite a few years. They are definitely one of my regular places to go to for new product. Uh, you just get pretty much everything there and uh, one shipping cost. Two, and th they've got the interesting stuff too. They've got these, um, they've always got lots of these exclusives. So we've got some more big four-door cars, Dodge Diplomat, Ford Crown, Victoria LTD. <clears throat> oh, okay, we're starting to see the end of the box, but look at, we've still got that much left to look at, guys. I don't know how long this video's running, but time is moving in warp speed and slow speed for me right now. Because it's just a whole lot of fun doing this sort of mystery unboxing. It's a self-made mystery unbox. Okay, we got another one of these. I'm pretty sure, did I collect? I don't know if I've shown you this. Oh, yeah, I did show this car to you. It's the Caprice Classic from the uh, Series 40 Hot Pursuit. I guess it's the only one I got in that series. Yep, two, times two. And a 2021 Chevrolet Tahoe. It's all blacked out. Uh, very cool. Another. That's another exclusive, so that's going to be in the exclusive mix. Greenlight exclusives. This is going to be the video for that one. Well, we'll just empty the box at this point, get everything out so you know how much is ahead in case you're pressed for time. Something like that. This is what we've got left. And that is the end of the box. Just a massive box. Okay, we've got some room now on the table. Get these opened up, these last uh, bundles of joy. Ooh, we do have some more uh, NYPD. That's cool. That's a Greenlight exclusive. I'm going to sneeze. I know it. Not much I can do about that. Edit it out, I guess. Uh, another 81 Ford LTD, Massachusetts. Really like that one. There it is. Excuse me. Thank you for any blessings. Uh, ow! Just poked myself right in the thumb with a dull knife. Look at this thing. 68 Plymouth GTX Hemi Convertible. That's also an exclusive. Oh, that's going to be a tough one to open. I will normally open all my green lights. I, I am going to open it. Very nice. It's going to match the orange GTX that I got in the last video. Also, Falcon Tires Jeep. Jeep JL. Is that a Jeep JL or a Jeep JK? It's a 2021, so I think it's a JK. Could be a... Yeah, it's a JK. Doesn't have the... Uh, no, it's a JL. It's a JL. Hard to say unless you look for the you look closely at 164 scale. Easier to see in 1-1 scale. Oh, and I got another one of these. This one's a JK 2020. You saw that one already in a previous video, so extra. And the Chevy Impala. 67 Chevy Impala. This is a uh, exclusive as well. Exclusive of what? We'll find out later. I don't know. We've seen that casting a lot over the years. Not recently, now I've got the hiccups. Now I've got the hiccups. Almost time for a swig of coffee. Great way to spend a Friday morning. Coffee and cars, right? Coffee and cars, why not? Give me that coffee, I need a drink. Mm. Choke. <coughs> oh my lord. Oh, these are gonna be two of the best favorite vehicles in here. Wow, the weathered 87 GMC Sierra K2500. Heck yeah, guys. <laughs> and it comes with the guy. Oh, man, I hope I got more of those. I hope I didn't just buy one. That, that would be ridiculous if I only got one. Same with this one. Sheriff Absur Absaroka County. Ford Bronco 94 XLT. This one's on the other side of the law. 
actually going back to uh, 96 or 97, whenever OJ went down the highway in his Bronco. Broncos chasing Broncos. All right. Oh, look at that. There it is. There's the orange one I got from before. I think we already looked at that one. So that's the matching. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Very nice. Well, now I'm going to have to get a second one of that. What am I going to do with two of those open? That would be silly. Uh, 77 Plymouth Fury from the, uh, I think this is the unofficial County Road slash Dukes of Hazard sort of series. Very cool. Two bundles left. Why did I not get more of these tow trucks? Well, I'll put that on the hit list. Gotta have more tow trucks for the junkyard, especially weathered ones. Pre-weathered is great. Uh, wow, a cool, speaking of Broncos, 2021 Ford Bronco. This one's the Barrett Jacksons. Sold for 1075000 What? For a Bronco? That's crazy. Uh, another Dodge Diplomat. Very sweet. Very, very sweet. That's the Veterans Cab. Two vehicles left. No, they are not duplicates. So let's see what they are. Well, they might be duplicates, but they're not of the thing we just looked at. Nope. We've got the alternate color International Scout from Johnny Lightning. Very cool. So that's where's the blue one? Blue, 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 blue. There, blue. I think those are the same series. Yes, they're both release three. So there they are. Release three. Very cool. And the final car, one I already have, but I wanted one on the packaging just in case. I probably do. It's probably my third one. But the Christine car, it's a great weather junkyard car. That's the whole lot, guys. I'm going to grab the camera and just show you this stuff out. Stick around for a bonus round, actually. Let's, uh, well, I mean, this is just bubble wrap, so we'll save that for later. We've got a lot of stuff to look at here. And now just to quickly summarize how much cool stuff we've got here. The entire set of HD Trucks Series 22 coming out for their own review. As well as one, two, three, four, five boxes of Auto World, six boxes of Auto World, a sealed box of Greenlight, a sealed box of Hot Wheels Premium, Fast and the Furious, the entire SD Trucks Series 14 with some brand new castings that we haven't seen, at least not in the regular release, and just an absolute plethora of individual Auto World, Johnny Lighting, and Greenlight cars as promised. Many of these you've never seen before, I've never seen before, and many of these, most of these, coming out for a loose review in their own right. We've got so many videos to do, and that doesn't even include what we've already got in the Hot Wheels room, so i got to get busy, guys. Because even in the Hot Wheels room, I have things I wanted to video and should have done by now, but unfortunately I took on a little bit more work than I can handle this uh, past month. We've got the M2 Auto World Mini GT Jedi. Um, Era, Johnny Lightning, Aut more Auto World, and of course Green Light. Not to mention, I've got this huge sort that was underway and is just about finalized of my Hot Wheels Beater Collection. We're going to do something really creative with that, so stay tuned. And of course, happy hunting. Right, Nina? Happy hunting.